Construction at this unique housing project in the heart of Los Angeles is almost done. The three-story structure is made up of eight recycled shipping containers from China. And when finished, it will permanently house 32 homeless people. But there's one thing that sets this project apart from all other homeless housing initiatives. There is no taxpayer money being used. This is a for-profit business model. So 56 private investors are helping to build this facility, and they expect to get about a 5% return on investment annually. The mastermind behind this $3.5 million social impact equity project is private developer Flyaway Homes. When they gave them the profit motive of getting a 4 or 5% return on their investment, they felt that that was a, a beautiful combination of meeting their needs of social impact and at the same time getting a fair return. Because Flyaway Homes is a private enterprise, cumbersome and expensive government regulations are bypassed, which helps lower costs and dramatically shorten construction time. For example, according to city data, Government housing rules require one unit per person, which costs approximately $400,000. Flyaway Homes, with the help of social services agency The People Concern, will place four people per unit at a cost of $100,000 per head. In working with The People Concern, they told us that the most important thing was privacy, that each person needed their own bedroom. Right. And so we have four bedrooms here. Each one is about 8 by 10. And then this is the open uh, living space. So okay. we'll have a sofa and a flat screen TV. Nice. And this is the dining space. The People Concern will master lease the complex from Flyaway Homes find qualified tenants who pay a modest rent using housing vouchers and disability benefits and provide services such as therapy and counseling. CEO John Masseri says this is a good alternative solution to solving homelessness in L.A., which exceeds 53,000 people. But he's direct about what more needs to be done. I don't know anybody working on the ground who gets up in the morning scratching their head saying, gee, we, we don't know what to do. We know exactly what to do. If we could get the resources and folks would get out of the way and you know let us get about the business of housing people, we would be making significant progress. For Felix Garcia, who was homeless for 12 years and now works with the people concerned, taking action isn't about if, but when. One of the things I can share for sure is for people to jump into the bandwagon volunteer, donate, and get busy with us. And for Flyaway Homes, that means setting a goal to build 20 projects a year in L.A. with the hope that other cities across the country will jump on their bandwagon. May Lee, CGTN, Los Angeles.